Our dirt bag rabbit. And I'm gonna teach you how to shame them today. Now, the army ain't the only place for shaming. The Air Force has many a fantastic sham as well. And when you add aircraft into a sham, the potential is endless. Shoot, you could even sham yourself a free vacation. Maybe you're tired. Maybe you need a little bit of a break. Maybe your plane just landed in Hawaii, Jamaica, the coast of Spain. Fill in the blank layer. And you want to get a taste of the local flavor, if you know what I mean. Talk about boobies, son. Or maybe for you leche airmen out there, a tall foreign man, handsome, skin, kissed by your son. Woo! Getting me a chat feeling when I read Fifty Shades of Grey for the first time. Ah! Just gotta watch out for them bugs. Should probably get myself a can of Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Shadow Legends is increasing its fantastic roster of champions with a brand new rarity, Mythical. And they've got a new mechanic called Metamorph, which lets them change between two different forms. Mythical champions are basically two champions in one, and you can change between their forms with unique Metamorph skills. Some of these awesome Mythical champions from the brand new Red Primal Shards in the portal. These Mythical champions are the most versatile champions you're gonna see in Raid, and you can tailor your playstyle and create synergies between the two forms. This October, be prepared to be scared with Raid! There's some real tricks and treats in the Raid Yard this year. Download Raid Shadow Legends using the link below. Copy your in-game player ID and then venture over to the raidyard.polarium.com from October 15th to November 10th. Enter your player ID, gather your courage, and then venture into the haunted graveyard. Grab a shovel and a pick and dig up some fantastic rewards, including real-life prizes. Ranging from epic and legendary themed champions to Amazon gift cards with a total of $20,000. If you're an existing Raid player, you can still get involved. Head to the same website listed below and you'll find a promo code that everyone can use. Use my link in the description or scan my QR code to get insane bonuses like the epic champion Talia, energy refill, skill tomes, and XP boosters. All this treasure will be waiting for you here. Just click the link in the description or scan the QR code. Now where were we? That's right. The federal government paying for your free vacation. Now this I am is simple. It is perfect. But that doesn't mean that it's bulletproof. The second you get too cocky in your sham is when you fall like Icarus, flying too close to the sun. Aim for the bushes. I'll give you an example. Just a few weeks ago, some fantastic high-level shaman airman got busted for doing a quick touchdown out in Martha's Vineyard to pick up a fantastic, beautiful motorcycle. Normally, I would not have an argument for that. Pick up your cores, pick up your ladies, and fly your way into the distant lands of whatever Air Force base you're going to. But they got caught. A shame. But there's also been incidents of Airmen getting their PP slammed because they intentionally broke their airplane while landing in a beautiful foreign country. A place some might consider a hot travel spot. How and why would you intentionally break an aircraft? Why? So you can spend a couple extra days in whatever oasis you just landed in. Your Air Force ain't just some jiffy lube. Maintenance might take a little bit of time. So while your aircraft is grounded, having its boost pack power flight controls looked at, you're out exploring the town and living free in temporary housing. How you break your aircraft intentionally is another question. You can't fake a flat tire, so I ain't telling you to go start stabbing aircraft tires. One, you're gonna lose your face. And two, you're gonna be brought up on charges. But, let's just say, that the fuel and hydraulic pump are showing some failures. Maybe that flight control computer is acting up. Well, you better get somebody on it. Just to be safe. Now, for some of those who might just lack a little bit of imagination, here's what it might look like. Sir, uh, we have thoroughly enjoyed our time here in the Virgin Islands. Uh, we can't wait to get back home to Alaska. It's gonna be great. But we have noticed that there are some issues with our aircraft that we've just been made aware of. Oh dear, is it anything serious? I'm afraid so. While doing our pre-flight checks, the engine failed to light off, and the pilot also noted a degradation in the stick actuator. Well, that does sound alarming. I should notify command. No, 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 not necessary, sir. <laughs> you see, after we notice all the POL failures, we call in a sortie suppression team. Yep, and it says here they're gonna assist with any of the APG exhaustion. Good to hear. Uh, how long do you expect the aircraft to be grounded until all these infractions are corrected? As long as we don't have any issues with the flight line deficit, I'm sure that we'll be able to get this taken care of in just three days. Excellent. Outstanding. 
I'll be sure to contact Base Housing and let them know about your extended stay. Oh, and keep it on the down low. The Niners get super butthurt about all the travel you guys do. And there you have it. The best vacation that you're ever going to have. That your military is going to pay for. So shame on, privates. Shame on. Now, I've been getting a lot of flack from a bunch of you weirdos saying I don't know how to pack a carton of cigarettes for shit. So let me share some knowledge with you dummies. How many times do you think I've gotten out of a detail if I'm over at the smoke pit? How do you think none of these are ever lit? Silly boots, learn how to shine them. <laughs>